It's only the magic man, Paul Mercer. Now, are you, Merce? Hello, mate. Nice to see you. Yeah, mate. Nice yeah. to see you. Are you up for this? Yeah. Red or blue challenge? Yeah. Before we start, what do you think you are? Do you think you're red or blue? I'm blue. I'm a Chelsea fan, so I'm blue. Get in. Go on, I'm Chelsea. blue. All right. The, uh, the object of this challenge is to... Uh, we're going to ask you red or blue related questions. They're not all football questions. Uh, and you have to give us an answer. You can't dodge any of these... politics or anything. No, no, no politics no, no, no. in there. You have to give us an answer. You can't dodge any of these questions. And at the end, we will uh, decide whether you are blue or red. Are you ready? Yeah. Should we do it? Yeah. Right, Tubes. Merce, I'm going to start a bit of music. This reminds me when I was on Mastermind. <laughs> it's more intellectual than that, mate. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> the band Blue or Simply Red? Oh. Bit of Mick Hucknall. I have to say Mick Hucknall because I did meet him and he, my ex-wife uh, was a big Simply Red fan and the great Georgie Best got us in backstage to meet him, so I, I'm, I'm going to go with Mick Hucknall. Have you got a favourite Simply Red song? <laughs> Not really. I'll hold him back the years, really. Yeah, yeah. I know. Can you give us a bit? Hold him back the years. Yeah, that's lovely. Thanks, Paul. <laughs> yeah, go on. Blue tit or Red Robin? I'm going to go Red Robin because when I was at school, when I was a kid, that we, that was one of the things we always used to have to colour in. Yeah. <laughs> I know that sounds weird, but yeah, that was one of my memories. That's, when I was a young kid, we always, always, you know, coloured in a, a Red Robin. Yeah. Hi, Bree, or Stamford Bridge? <clears throat> no, I, 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 when I grew up, Stamford Bridge wasn't the best of grounds. It was terrible. And uh, shed the electric fence, yeah, I was a white wall in the shed. But I, I still think Ibra is one of the best grounds. I think if you ask any professional footballer, I think it was a top, top ground. So I, I'm going to go. I'm going to go with that again. I'm going to go with Ibra. Is that red. another red? Yeah, another red. Sure, come oh, up. Might as well finish might as well, this now. Might as well just take that off anyway. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Got a blue shirt on as well. You might as well take that off. Whoa, steady. <laughs> Chelsea or Arsenal? Yep, yeah, Chelsea. Played for Arsenal, but Touch I said, me. No, I don't like doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, I like, I'm like. i going to go with definitely Chelsea. I'm a Chelsea fan. Brilliant. Yeah. Have you ever worn red or blue boots? Yeah, I've worn red boots uh, at Middlesbrough, high-tech ones. In the League Cup final, I wore red ones. I don't know why we got slaughtered. We didn't even get in the game. Pathetic. <laughs> you know, the last thing you want to do is wear red boots and not have a good game. That is really bad. So yeah, red boots. Bloods or Crips? I don't know. <laughs> Who's the artist? Both, pr both pretty handy, I think. Are they? Yeah. I don't really want to step on their manner, do you know what I mean? If I say one and I'm caught on that manner, if I ever go to LA, yeah, I'm well, in trouble. I, yeah. I, I want to cover my own. And I want to go to LA on holiday, so... Brips. If it, yeah. I've got to go... I've got to go the blue. The Crips? Crips. Yeah, I've got to go Crips. I have to. I have to, yeah. And I've got a big toe. You started that. a big beef there, you know, you know, you know that, don't you? I know, I'm, I'm struggling. I'll, I'll probably, probably go Clacton on holiday. Really, yeah. <laughs> probably have you get, to you go to I'd probably have to swerve LA. <laughs> if you do end up there, what are you going to say to the Bloods when they come for you? Uh, they made me say it. <laughs> they made me. I, I, I don't know. Nicole Kidman or Marge Simpson? Lovely red head and a lovely blue head. No, seriously? Yeah. Mm. Really? Yeah. One's a cartoon character. Whatever flex And the other boat. one's an absolute salt. So I've got to go red. And finally, was your greatest day in football as a red or a blue? No, I definitely as a red. To play for Arsenal. Yeah, I definitely as a red. To play at Arsenal at Wembley in a cup final and, and to play for Arsenal. Because my dad was a big Arsenal fan, so... That was his dream, so yeah, that was definitely at Arsenal. It's been revealed that you are actually a red. Well, How do you feel about that, Paul Merson? I just feel the questions were probably stereotyped, really. Really, I, I think it would have been better if you'd have put them along and I, I drew out what one I wanted, what question, just as a chance. Because they're the questions for everybody. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, well, so okay. You've had a few blues. Well, I'm a red then. But would I, you say I just you're thought they were different. Yeah, I would say blue. But then it, I played for Arsenal for 14 years, so there is a case. Mm. Thanks, Paul. Thank you for having me. Thanks very much. Thank you. Cheers. 
you send my console to... <laughs> no, I'm <laughs> <laughs>